Hello, my name is I King Skies, and today we are back with a new Monday Night Raw review, or just, I guess we're just talking about it, I guess it comes for just talking about it, first of all, can I say that Drew McIntyre is a fucking idiot, I mean, this dude, he goes to Shawn Michaels, he says, I just feel, I feel bad that you guys are getting, I just feel like I'm the reason, and you're not the reason, but you said you feel like the reason you've seen what Randy Orton has done to other legends and you don't come out there with him? I mean, you, <laughs> nigga, what? I just don't understand. And and second of all, this dude Randy Orton has bodies on bodies. I mean, God damn. Let's see. Big Show, Edge, Christian, Ric Flair, Shawn Michaels. I mean, come on. I really hope he doesn't win a belt because that would... Oh man, that would bury Drew McIntyre. That would, oh Jesus, that would Triple H Booker T bury him. Godly. Anyway, that was a solid segment. I mean, Drew McIntyre should have been out there with him because it was obvious Randy Orton was going to try to attack him. You know, <laughs> you know what was funny? Randy Orton, like, he tried to punt him real quick and get up out of there. That was that was kind of funny. That was kind of funny. Then he went back for more and got his ass whooped and then countered it and then hit the RKO on Drew McIntyre, which made Drew McIntyre look fucking ass. But maybe it's, I'm talking too much, but maybe Drew McIntyre was what was to look ass on purpose to let him win on SummerSlam. Huh? Huh? Anyway, good segment. Uh, 7 out of 10. I don't know. We had... Um, Liv Morgan and Ruby Riot take on the Iconics. Well, Ruby Riot take on Peyton Royce. Can I just say, Peyton Royce is just so beautiful in the ring. I mean, her sales, her, her attacks is just so good. Um, Peyton Royce wins. Uh, Ruby Riot kind of nice too, but she didn't. She fell off. She fell off. Anyway, um, they win. Uh, cool segment. Uh, I really hope Liv Morgan and Ruby Riot are the future tag team champions and the Iconics break up and Peyton Royce is a single um, person because there's been rumors. But anyway, um, I would enjoy that. I enjoyed it. Um, the segment today, though, was kind of weird because how do you get knocked out? How does Liv Morgan, like Peyton Royce, like touched her with her pinky and Liv Morgan was just dead. Like Liv Morgan pushed Ruby Riot into Liv... Uh, into Liv Peyton Royce pushed um Ruby Riot into Liv Morgan Liv Morgan fell down and then she just died for the rest of the match anyway we had Rey Mysterio and Dominic probably the segment of the night um Rey Mysterio came out here talking all big stuff and Seth Rollins and Do uh, Seth Rollins and Murphy they come down there and he's like bro come on bro you guys are an idiot if you think you have a chance to beat us. Well, Seth Rollins is now an idiot because when he came out there, Rey Mysterio and Dominic had a plan and they executed perfectly. Dominic grabbed the Kindle sticks, kind of acted like he was hurt. And um, yeah, uh, segment of the night. Uh, and Seth Rollins, before that, came out to Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe was hilarious, man. He was like, why you shook? Why you shook, bro? Why you shook? Anyway, yeah. Uh, what else happened? It was a good show tonight. Um, oh, Alexander is probably going to turn heel at SummerSlam. Um, anything else? Uh, Apollo Crews tried to make us serious, but is it me? or I just can't take him serious. I mean... Not only do I picture him as a milk dud every time he comes out, but he just, <laughs> he's just, I don't know, bro. I don't know. He's just Mr. Good Guy, and I can't take him serious when he gets serious. Anyway, MVP with some, uh, he's been killing it lately. Like, with his promos and stuff, Bobby Lashley has been killing it, too, just in the ring, but um, that's booking-wise. Anyway... Um, that was good. Um, 
what else? What else can I do? I'm trying to hurry up and get through this because of YouTube and I only have 29 subscribers. So if I search it up there, let me let me stop talking. Let me stop talking. Let me get through this. Um, so yeah, it was a good it was a good um Monday Night Raw. Uh if my if I'm forgetting oh Raw Underground. Um, I've had my own opinions about Raw Underground, but what I liked was Shayna Baszler introducing her UFC friends to um, Raw Underground. And if it wasn't for um, me seeing Nia Jax today and her being in a feud, I would, I would actually that would have been really great for me. I mean, that was cool, but I saw Nia Jax, so I have to give it um, six out of ten. Anyway, um, yeah, Raw Underground didn't dis well. It didn't make me mad today. I mean, it's still raw underground. I just don't like it. It's just me. It's my opinion. Some people might not um, agree with me. Anyway, that is my my um, my review. That is my review of Monday Night Raw. Um, if you like this video, um, like, subscribe comment down below my name is i king skies thanks for watching but what do you do when there's no place to turn i have